everyone welcome to my youtube channel my name is tv yes you heard me right tv like a television and today i'm going to be unboxing a celine nano tote bag so this is the first bag i've ever owned by celine and i've held on to this bag for a couple of weeks now just to do an unboxing video so i'm really excited to finally be opening up this box so that I can finally use the bag. My boyfriend had purchased this for me for my birthday and I am so grateful and so thankful. We purchased the bag from Saks Fifth Avenue in Palm Beach on Worth Avenue. And when I saw the bag in store, I knew that it was just meant to be and I had to get it because I've been trying to find this bag for the longest time. But every time I went into a store, it seemed to be out of stock in this particular color. And the store associate was so kind enough to be able to box up this bag for me and tie it in this beautiful bow so that I could open it up for my birthday. So we're gonna unbox this on camera with you guys so that we can finally see what the bag looks like. Here it is. The big reveal. So it comes in this black dust bag to protect the bag. And here it is. Here is the dust bag with the logo in front. It says Celine Paris. It is a black dust bag and then has adjustable straps at the top to secure the bag. And it is a very thick dust bag. I've never felt a dust bag this thick, but if you look at the inside, there's actually an extra layer of lining. So it's double layered to really protect your Celine bag. Anyways, here is the bag that I got. It is the Celine Nano Luggage Tote Bag in this beautiful gray color. Depending on the lighting, it could either look darker or lighter. The name of the color is Kohl, K-O-H-L, and I've really just been eyeing this color for a very long time. I also got this bag in the gold hardware, as you can see along the zippers. I think the gold detailing really matches well with this color. This is definitely not a trendy bag. I feel like this style is very classic and very timeless, which is why I want to get this bag and here's what it looks like on the outside there's a zipper right here where you could probably hold very very small things and then the handles are right here which is the perfect size for me because I'm actually a very small person so I'm able to loop my arm through here very easily I feel like this bag is the perfect size for me because it's not too big and not too small and based on a lot of the reviews that I watch on this bag it should hold a lot of things. Here is the little zipper at the top which I like because I like bags that have zippers because it feels more secure and then it comes with tissue paper right here which I like to keep inside the bag whenever I'm not using it so that it holds its shape. Also on the back, there's this little hook right here. A lot of people tell me that this hook is so that you can keep your sunglasses on there to just hang onto the bag. And here is where you put the straps on. There's gold hardware on the side as well. It also comes with Celine instructions. This is what the bag looks like when there is nothing inside of it. Here is a little compartment that you can keep cards or possibly a card holder. This little tab right here, it says made in Italy. I really like how hollow it is on the bag so that you can keep more things in it and then easily take things out and put things in. This is what the bottom of the bag looks like. There are no stands on it, but this bag is known to hold up pretty well. Here is what 
the strap looks like. It is in the same color as the bag and it comes with the lobster claps which I really like because it'll stay secured on the bag really well and the claps also turns so you don't really have to worry about which side you place the strap on which is nice and then you can see along the claps if you look really closely it says Celine and on the back of it it says Paris so they have that imprinted on both sides which really shows that these straps are Celine the strap that comes with this size bag is one of the main reasons why I chose this size because I really like how versatile it is I don't always like to keep my bag in my arms sometimes I like to wear it cross body sometimes I like to wear it across my shoulder so I really like that you have the option of that along with that this size is also lighter than the bigger version of this bag I've heard that this bag can be really heavy when you stuff contents inside of it and since I'm such a small person already I didn't want it to hurt my arms whenever I'm carrying the bag for long periods of time after doing my research I figured this would be the best option for me because it is a bag that I want to be able to use pretty often since it's in a very casual style and I just like that since it comes with a strap I'll be able to to style it in many different ways. If you look very closely, you'll notice that the leather has this grainy effect and that is because I chose to get this bag in the baby drummed calf skin, which is a more durable leather, mainly because I wanted something that will be able to hold itself together and not scratch so easily since I do plan on using this bag pretty often. Although I will say that the smooth leather does look very nice, but I just didn't want to have to baby the bag, so I opted for this material instead. The dimensions of this bag are 8 inches by 8 inches by 4, so the height is 8 inches, the width is 8 inches, and then you have the depth, which is 4 inches. And that is all I have to show you guys for today. Thank you so much for- Merry Christmas. Why are you giving it to me now? You're gonna unbox it now and use it. Wait, but I have to finish my video. Let's do your video. Anyways, sorry guys, we ran out of battery, so we are back to the scheduled programming. I have to show you guys how stunning this packaging is. I'm not sure if it's seasonal or not because it is not the Christmas packaging that I saw online, but either way, this is just so beautiful and I am going to be keeping this box in my collection forever. Let's unbox it and see what exactly is inside. You guys might see this before I do. So let me know what's inside. Oops, all right, so here it is. Oh, just kidding. <laughs> got me the Twilly that I was actually just looking at the other day so I have no idea how he got it that quickly and I wasn't expecting to get it at all because he told me that I need to be saving money and not purchasing things like this so I was like mm, I'm not gonna look at it anymore I'm gonna put it away this is just so beautiful and I just love how versatile Christian Dior Twillies are. But I really wasn't expecting this to be 
my Christmas gift. So I'm so excited because this is gonna go so nicely with the new bag that I have. So here is what the design looks like on the front. There is this beautiful floral design. And then on the back of it, there's this pink with black borders and it says Christian Dior. So I can't wait to use this Twilly and wrap it on the new bag that I got. By the way, you guys are getting my live reactions right now. I have no idea what he got me at all. And so I'm really excited to see what this all is because I didn't really mention that I wanted anything recently. Ooh. Oh! It says, Santa got you this, and I see the brand, so I know it's from that jewelry company that I've been really eyeing lately because I think their jewelry is so simple yet so unique and they have the most stunning designs. This jewelry brand is P.D. Paola. I think that's how you pronounce it. I'm really not sure how to pronounce this brand, but here is the name of it, if you guys can see it on camera. And I saw their advertisement on my Facebook feed, and I just think their jewelry designs are just so beautiful. I'm so excited that my boyfriend got me this bracelet that I was looking at not too long ago. It's so pretty, like their jewelry is just so dainty and cute. Ah, I'm so excited to wear this because it's definitely one of those simple everyday pieces. It's so cute! What do you think? That's what I wanted to get you because I actually love that thing so much. You like it a lot? Yeah, I loved it so much. I was worried I wouldn't make it in time because it came from Spain. This came from Spain? Uh -huh. Thank you, boyfriend. Oh my gosh, this is so cute! So you have, you see these crystal rhinestones over here and then over here they have the chain links. It's a very cute and tiny bracelet. And I was looking at the dimensions on the website and it should perfectly fit my wrist and it's easily adjustable too. It's very rare to find bracelets in my size so I'm really excited that I can wear this. I hope you guys enjoyed this unexpected video. Thank you so much for watching, and I hope to see you guys in the next one. Bye!